Well, welcome to part two of uh, stretching a fine art canvas, although I've decided to keep this a bit shorter and just do uh, putting the stretcher bars together on this one and I'll follow on with stretching afterwards, otherwise I get bored doing it and you'll get bored watching me. So I hope you enjoy this. Thank you. Bye. Just looking at the stretcher bars we're going to use. These are lion picture stretcher bars. They're, um, I don't know what the right term is. They're sort of like uh, joined together, so they don't warp. Uh, we've used Harris Moore as well. They're very good. Uh, there are others out there, obviously. Um, but it's important to get something that doesn't warp, and these don't. So, here we go. It's a struggle putting these together, but... Um, um, I've speeded it up just to save you watching too much. Uh, the first thing is just to get it together roughly. Uh, the corners are all sort of looking tightly fitted um, and then we'll uh, square it up from there. Finally, just need to get this uh, square, and it does need to be pretty square. Um, prints are very unforgiving. My wife has an easy time with originals, as uh, she then paints on them, and they can be uh, almost any shape, and sometimes are. So that's it for part two of putting the stretcher bar together. Back to part three, stretching the canvas. That's it for now. Thank you. Bye.